every time we win, it feels good. You know, uh, it was one of those performances where these guys did a lot of work for me. You know, uh, my job was to go out there and you know, obviously throw strikes and get out. So I think I did for the most part of that. And these guys got me some runs and made some great plays. I mean, uh, you can't say enough about. You know, Dougie scooping some balls out of the, you know, out of the dirt on, on some big plays. Jeter up the middle, A Rod on some plays. You know, up up uh, ahead of the ahead of the mound, some of the plays in the outfield. I mean, that's how we're going to win ball games. Carl, what was, the way you've been progressing all spring is this kind of what you've been working towards with a game like this? Yeah, I mean, I felt good coming out of the pen. You know, I, I thought, you know, I had a good rhythm going, and the guys scored me some runs early, which you know, any pitcher lets them relax a little bit and go out and work your stuff and. You know, I mean, uh, for the most part, I don't think it was a dominant outing, but I definitely got a chance to go deep in the in the um, into the game, which gives our um, you know our pen a little bit of a break. And you know, these guys did a lot of the work. I mean, especially behind me, you know, I was getting a lot of ground balls, and they were making plays. And, and for me, that's that's the key for me to stay in the, the game, the ball game for a while. Oh, Ron Guidry wanted you to be aggressive and go after guys, throw strikes. How mindful were you of that as this outing went along? Um, yeah, I mean, obviously that's that's how I've been my whole career. I've always wanted to go out there and be aggressive. You know, um, my last start I was kind of spotty, so this time I, I definitely wanted to go out and, and get ahead of hitters. And for the most part, I did that, and I was able to work in some pitches that, you know, with the lead we had that, you know, in other tight games I might be a little more aggressive with the fastball. But, you know, that that was just one of the, one of those starts where you got to go out and you know you got a bit of a cushion so you could be aggressive and get away with a little bit, a little bit there. Joe talked about how much he liked your competitiveness. Have you almost had to relearn a little bit of that just because no matter what throwing you do on the side, it's not in the game? Yeah, I mean, I, I mean I, I've mean, i been through injuries before. You know, obviously this, this time period has been a bit, a bit longer than other times. But I think just getting a good game plan and, and being aggressive is my key. I mean, uh, like Gator said. So, I mean, I definitely wanted to go out there today. I was ahead of, ahead of a lot more hitters in my last start. So, I mean, that's a key for me. And like I said, these guys made some great plays behind me, which, you know, gets some momentum on our side. To get your first win since May 22nd, 2005, does it seem like a lifetime since then, or does that seem like yesterday? You know, it's, some days it feels like yesterday, some days it feels like a lifetime. But I'm glad to have all that behind me and move forward. And, you know, now as a, as a team, we can keep moving forward from here. Andy Pettit talked yesterday about needing one of these to kind of get this staff rolling. How ironic. It's almost going to be strange that it's you that does it, but it must also be a tremendous source of pride. No one would have bet on you. I take that as a compliment or not. I don't know if coming into this season anyone would have necessarily <laughs> yeah. bet, bet on you on that. I understand that. But, uh, I mean, someone's got to go out there and do it, and I'm, I'm glad I was the guy, to tell you the truth. Um, you know, I, as you said, I've been through an awful lot, and this, this team's, you know, stuck behind me through it all, so I'm glad I could give back at, the, at this time and throughout the season as well.